Hey guys, and thank you so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, we'd really appreciate it if you would. Today we're going to take a look at a Lenovo Tiny Think Center PC, the M70Q Gen 2. This one's powered by Intel, and I really like these Tinies because they're very compact, but you can open them up and actually access things inside. The RAM's removable, you can throw a 2.5 inch drive in them, and this came with an NVMe SSD that's quite fast. It includes a power adapter and a wired keyboard and mouse, as well as a little stand. It does not include a monitor, but it's really neat if you pair it with a tiny in one monitor. It'll actually slide into the back and you can kind of make your own all in one. I'm not going to go over how that works because I have other videos showing that, so I'll link that in the description. We're going to go over the specs, the outside and inside, and benchmarks as well. Let's take a look. This tiny PC has an Intel Core i5-11400T 6-core processor. 1.3 GHz base, 3.7 GHz turbo. Intel B560 chipset. Intel UHD Graphics 730. 8 GB of DDR4 RAM. 256 GB NVMe SSD. USB 3.2 Gen 1 and Gen 2. Gigabit Ethernet. Intel Wi-Fi 6 AX201. Realtek HD Audio. TPM 2.0. Optional Visa mount, Tiny in one compatible, Windows 10 Pro 64 bit and has a three year warranty. On the front of the Tiny PC is the power button, which includes a power light, a hard drive access light, USB Type C, USB Type A, and an audio combo port. On the back is the Lenovo Slim Tip power adapter slot for the included power adapter. Display port, four USB type A, HDMI, and this one has another display port, but this could be different depending on which one you order. Some of them have HDMI or even VGA there. And then this one is also available with a serial port here. There's gigabit ethernet and an antenna connector. The antenna is included, it's just not pre-installed and it does just screw on. There's a Kensington lock location here as well. This has feet to be able to lay flat on a table. There's an optional Visa mount to attach it to the back of a monitor. This fits inside a Lenovo Tiny in one monitor. Also includes a stand if you want to stand it up vertically. To access the inside of the Tiny PC, all you have to do is remove one Phillips head screw from the back of the chassis. Then take the top lid and slide it forward and lift it off. Inside you can see the only system fan which blows directly over the processor which is located under here. There's a two and a half inch caddy for a spinning drive or SSD with SATA data and power connector here. There's the Wi-Fi and Bluetooth module. If you flip it over, there's another panel that slides forward and lifts off. Inside you'll see the NVMe SSD location and two SODIMM slots. On this model, we only have one populated with a single 8 gig stick. The overall pass mark score for this PC is 2943, the 38th percentile. The CPU mark is 12572, the 61st percentile. The 2D mark is 254, the 22nd percentile. The 3D mark would not complete on multiple runs, and I've had this issue with integrated graphics lately. The memory mark is 2391, the 42nd percentile. The disk mark is 23060, the 88th percentile. These tiny PCs are really cool, and they're still very powerful for how small they are. There's not a lot that's a better value than this on the market today. If you intend to purchase one of these, if you can use the link in the description, it'll help support our channel. If you have any questions, please put them in the comments below. Please like, share, and subscribe. And if there's anything you want to add I didn't include, please put that in the comments as well. I'm always glad to learn something new. Thanks!